Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So this is gonna be a reading for the sign of Pisces. Pisces, my readings are timeless, so when you see them is when you're meant to hear them. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please don't forget to hit the post notification bell so you can get alerts when my videos are posted. Pisces, if you wish to donate towards my channel, all the links are in the description box down below. So let's get into your reading. Okay, Pisces, somebody is trying to seduce you. Or you could be trying to potentially seduce somebody. I'm getting they trying to seduce you, okay? Somebody's attracted to you. Somebody wants to flirt with you. Somebody wants to date you. Somebody's trying to hook up with you. Somebody thinks you're pretty hot and tempting. And also, there's a third-party interference here. So, listen. As many cards as I, as many times as I didn't see this card, I never got that somebody's friend is trying to play interception. Um, so somebody trying to block something. Somebody likes you, but meanwhile, there's somebody that's friends with them that's trying to talk to you. And I don't know if they know it. But either way, whoever this person is could potentially be your twin flame. Um, it's like yin and yang, your zen energy, bringing something into balance, something into union, um, duality, a coupling, complementing each other. So whoever the person is that's watching you behind the scenes, Somebody else is watching them watching you, and basically they're trying to play interception. They want to mess this thing up. So we have the sword and the rose, clarity, truth of revelation, solidarity, force, and honor. Also power and protection there. All right, Pisces. And, and, and beauty and the beast, sword and the rose. Okay. All right, let's see what we got here. The Lantern Fairy, a clear solution. So that always, Lanterns is like showing light, shedding light on something to me always. Um, so a clear solution coming out of nowhere and the Fairy of Highlands, it's time to be brave, okay? So somewhere, somehow you about to have to snap, okay? <laughs> <laughs> all right so i'm hearing you with the shits anyway so it's whatever what you want to do you got the sword and the rose which one do you want you want the soft gentle me or do you want the let's get it version so sword and the rose pisces um i'm hearing evil twin so good person good good cop bad cop which one do they want so it's time to be brave a clear solution something about to happen the numbers are 20 and 24 or 42 uh-oh pisces a little bit of fishies standing your ground standing on guard king of swords yeah some you gonna have to check somebody Somebody gonna need to get checked. Cause somebody is totally about the to lie. That's all I'm feeling. Like, um, whoever your twin flame is, whoever your partner, soulmate, you, the yin to your yang, um, whoever that person is that's surrounding them is totally about to lie about something. That's all I feel. Like either this person is trying to message you in some form or fashion, and that could be texting your phone under the 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 premise of something else or trying to play with your you on social media but either way this person is trying to make it seem like you are giving them rhythm like you are like you're being flighty or like having choices a lot of like people just don't know how to not mind their business um okay so we have the seven of wands here a challenge a competition protection perseverance Defense, maintaining, maintaining control. So basically, stand in your guard, okay? Stand in your guard, stand in your ground. Again, feeling like to me, like somebody about to have to get checked because somebody's up to some BS. So being defensive, on guard, standing your ground, courage in the face of opposition. Time to be brave. So again, looks like you're going to have to confront something head on. 
um, the hangman is like being in limbo, letting go and letting God, knowing that the only way to handle this situation is to just let it play out, okay? King of Swords energy here, head over heart, very dip, um, dip, diplomatic or very disciplined, somebody that's very truthful, very honest, and mental clarity. So whatever it is, it's almost like this person standing back and they kind of know their person or they know their friend. Um, so they might not believe them anyway, because this is somebody who is a logical, deep thinker. And this person can spot when, cause this person's very smart. This person's a very, a great communicator. And this person knows when I'm hearing very emp like empathic, um, and very spiritual. So this person picks up energy is what I'm feeling. Seven of cups energy. Look at this shit. Lying, cheating, stealing, creating confusion, sneaky behavior, deception. Um, yeah, so somebody basically, some somebody that is connected to them is definitely shady. Or it could be somebody connected to you, Pisces, and they get ready lie on your person and say that this person tried to talk to them. Because we're not just going to let us off the hook either. It could be somebody that is in your energy that's doing that. I'm off the hook, period. I'm going to just let y'all know because I'm single, celibate, sober, ain't even entertaining, and ain't even around nobody. So, but either way, Seven of Cups, that was just my business. Um, daydreaming, wishful thinking, having too many options, choices, or ideas, indecision, abundance, wanting it all, and not knowing what you want. So, some type of discernment is here. Either way, somebody thinks you have choices on the table. Um... And somebody thinking that you're sneaky because somebody is saying that you're sneaky. Meanwhile, you working on your foundation. Trying to get shit together. Doing shit to get shit together. So, being very diligent. Um, having high standards. So, you're not just out here talking to any old smoke Joe Schmo. Um... But like I said, building your firm, building your foundation, working on your life, building what you need to build, planting seeds, um, manifestation, like waiting on your investments and things to grow. So you're being very responsible and very mature in your energy. Meanwhile, somebody around here playing around. All right, we got a ten of swords energy here is, and that's also the reason why you could be rebuilding a foundation, starting something over, planting seeds, changing how you have done things because somebody stabbed you in the back, okay? A painful ending, um, a betrayal, some type of loss, some type of failure, some type of collapse, some type of defeat, okay? And healing from that, okay? So now I'm building, shedding light. It's time to be brave. You gotta, you know, push forward. You gotta stand up and do what you gotta do. Um, and again, sometimes we might not like conflict, but don't start nothing won't be don't start nothing won't be none. So they started it, and maybe you might need to just you know kind of close it on out for them. You didn't start it. Okay, we got a King of Cups energy here. So some type of competition happening behind the scenes. Also something that you don't know about, but you do know now because I already told you somebody's friend is totally a friend of me, not a friend of me, a friend of me, an enemy behind the scenes. And they secretly plotting. <laughs> Yo, uh, then somebody said plotting on my girl. <laughs> so somebody plotting on a girl or plotting on a guy, but either way, some type of competition out here. We got the Empress coming out here. Um, yeah, creating this. This is funny. I don't know why, but I swear now I just want to laugh. Okay, so Empress energy, creating something, being very creative, um, and bringing things into fruition. So doing something that could, well, that is that can establish your life, rebuild your life, rebrand your life is what I'm hearing. So you could be a brand or you could have a brand either way, wealth and abundance in your energy, more bringing things into fruition, more birthing things. So if you can get pregnant, you could potentially be going to have a baby and I'm hearing somebody adopting. So adopting, 
creating boundaries here also in your energy listen it's a it's some foolery happening around here because it's almost giving me like these energies like i said earlier like i just don't want to deal with nobody's friend situation i don't want to like i just don't want to deal with y'all people so that's why for me it has to be like you got to be willing to be friends with them like later because again true friends understand that you have to tend to your life your relationship your like those types of things they don't need to be all up in your mix and this is the reason why right here because somebody is trying to interfere in somebody else's business um we got a page of pentacles a manifestation which is more manifesting on this table so pisces heavily manifesting the life you want the life you desire the life that you are creating or you wish to create so development ambition desire and being very diligent in a situation excited about love excited about life creating a commitment to learning something new ten of pentacles i told you wealth and abundance in your energy so whatever this is pisces you are in a change and transition mode like building wealth building establishing getting things together mm, we got the emperor out here okay emperor they trying to talk to your girl was that you <laughs> i'm cracking up so we got an empress and emperor energy out here sun at the bottom of the deck okay so okay um and i took it because it's a yes so apparently there's a marriage a bond a, a blend of a family and a situation happening also happening quickly somebody's changing their mind so i don't know what they're changing their mind from or for but somebody is tip uh, i was gonna say typically somebody is about to bust a you so somebody was going the opposite direction something happened they got to turn around um and it looks like it's happening very quickly. So there may have been some delays. Um, the person may have been frustrated. The person ha may have been held off, um, waiting. But right now, this person is in a panic. And they think that their slowdown has hindered them. So, And then we have the emperor here, which is structure, power, rules, logic, common sense. And it just makes sense for this thing to happen is what I'm hearing. It just makes sense for this person to do whatever this is that they're trying to do. It just makes sense. So practicality, um, discipline, focus. So a person being very focused on the task at hand, which is the same thing as that right there, building a firm foundation. And I can't fumble this. Like this is what they're saying. I can't fumble this again. So apparently somebody tried something that did not work and they fumbled. So somebody saying I can't fumble again. Um, then we have the Ace of Swords here. Uh, mental energy, a new idea, clarity, new plans, projects, breakthroughs, clear thinking, the ability to step back and see things without being emotional. A bright idea coming out of nowhere and all I keep hearing is somebody saying I gotta, I gotta make a, a good plan this time. It has to be a good plan this time. So the sun, very positive, happiness, pleasure, vitality, fun, joy, warmth, celebration, success, rebirth, and all is well. Um, something about a mistake. So somebody made a mistake here that caused some type of conflict and some type of chaos. So I don't know if this person... So we got one of two choices. So I don't know if this person sent this friend to test you or if the friend was sent to watch you. Either way, the friend fell in love or the friend likes you. Because that's the vibe that I'm getting because somebody is saying... All right, yes, definitely. They created a burden on themselves, on their own, which ended up making you now say, no way, Jose. I'm out of it. I'm just going to go. Somebody was being childish. 
creating heavy burden. So creating too much work on themselves. Um, and also a completion. So something being finished to the tune of it was finished so bad that God said, okay, well, I got to fix this and we got to adjust. So divine money and abundance, a manifestation Pisces, because apparently you wasn't with it anyway, a manifestation, a new opportunity in a career, a financial opportunity, a new venture and some prosperity in your energy. Um, something was made harder than what it should be. That's what that is. And now God's stepping in saying, okay, I saw that. But again, somebody fumbled the ball. I, I, I can't fumble this again. So now we got another man out here. So definitely some competition. So automatically there's some type of, um, look, when I said options from the beginning, there's totally total options. But Pisces, it looks like you done kind of went the other damn way. N the fool, new beginnings, possibilities, innocence. So that was like the Six of Cups, um, innocent, being very nostalgic. So letting go and trusting God, having blind faith, being very adventurous, um, opportunities. And I don't know, but guess what? One of these men that's out here on this board, because there's a lot of them, is a gigolo. So I don't know why. That's just the energy that I'm picking up, and that's just all I can hear. Like, this person is very much into everybody so that could also be a reason why pisces you going the other way and we got a couple out here why do we have two couples on the board so we got two couples or what should be two couples or maybe some type of growth so maybe that might be what it is people have some growing to do some leveling up some change um so like butterfly No, I feel like there's two couples. So why is that? Why do you have two couples in your energy and a bunch of men? Excuse me. So is this like, is that somebody's mom and dad? This card is back here again. So somebody wanting to bring you flowers, somebody wants you to remember something, somebody wants you to, um, somebody feels like you're very familiar to you, to them. Um, all day long, I've been getting um, like light orbs around me. And I turned around because I felt again, another one. So there's like, I don't know. Today has been fully the uh, uh, like a lot of spirits around. Um, childhood memories, nostalgia, reminiscing, happy memories. So, oh, they want you to remember the time. Remember the time before, like when they made you smile. Okay, so apparently Pisces, you must be being very mean or very some like some type or cold. That's the word, being very cold to somebody because they want you to remember the time when something was different. I think somebody's mom and dad is like involved in this situation too because literally that's the vibe that I'm feeling. More like it's almost like their group of friends and family or something. There's two guys and uh, it's either a mom and dad or somebody that's related to them that's married. But we got some people that is heavily invested in this situation. And everybody's trying to get some type of calm, like, you know, calming effect into this situation. Like, how do we get the situation to calm down? Um, well, I don't know. Because I don't see that part. I already see that there's a judgment made already. And I think that God made the judgment, or maybe you made the judgment, Pisces. But either way, somebody is totally in your energy trying to get you to back down. And why do you have to back down? That's the part I don't understand either. So they want you to back down. Because I feel like they think you're aggressive. 
which may be so, but how did you become aggressive? You became aggressive because somebody was in your energy playing to fuck around. And they fucked around and fucked around and found out. And now all of a sudden they want you to remember, remember this time. Well, you should have remembered it before we got to this point. Like, I don't understand. It's almost like to me, like people always want to do stuff. And as long as they could get away with it, they keep pushing. But then the minute you buck up to them, so you're standing your ground, you're on guard, you're very defensive. And now they saying, you're a little bit uptight. I need you to relax a little. Well, how the fuck did I get uptight? Make it make sense. I thought this was what you was asking for. Oh, you always go too far. Okay, so they didn't expect for you to go that far. Well, um, good people, you can't control people's reaction to what you do. And that's that. That's that on that. Okay, Pisces, so this is the reading. Um, hopefully it helped. Thank you for coming to my channel. If it resonates with you, don't forget to hit that like, share, and subscribe button. And if you wish to donate, the links are in the description box. Hit the like, share, and subscribe even if it didn't resonate with you, okay? Come back for some more good stuff because I got more, okay? Because I've been getting a lot of messages today. And like I said, it's been a lot of spirits around today. So I don't know what all the activity is for. But apparently something big is happening behind the scenes, Pisces, because they are totally in activation mode around this piece, okay? So thank you for coming. Go with God.